This coverage of the 2017 SHOT Show on the Gun Collective is brought to you by New Frontier Armory and Lehigh Defense. Be sure to click those links in the description to learn more about those great companies. Boys and girls, I've got something special for you. The guy sitting to my right has been a supporter of TGC News and TGC since literally day one. This is a gentleman from RE Factor Tactical. How are you, man? Good. How are you doing? I am fantastic. Now, I think it's important for the people at home to understand who supports TGC, what they do, and why they're special. I believe in what you guys do. I think it's really special. Um, I think you come with a new approach to a lot of things. And uh, why, don't, why don't you tell the TGC audience about who you are and what you do? Sure. So uh, RE Factor is, we're a veteran-owned, veteran-run company. Um, and we have multiple guys that work within the company that still work overseas, um, still do stuff in different parts of the uh, Department of Defense, government sectors, et cetera. And what we like to do is we like to take our experience overseas and apply that to a current market. So that's one of our biggest things is providing real-time products, real-time ideas that's being tested, developed overseas uh, by guys that are actually using it themselves. Right, and not only that, but I think a lot of the products have tons of crossover. I mean, I'm literally walking around, I don't know where it is sitting here, with one of your bags, the uh, SSE backpack. Yep. Yeah, and, and you know, we do try to develop things that are not just for uh, people working overseas, but can also be used by really anybody. Um, it, the reality is there's a lot of crossover, there's a lot of bleed over, and we understand that. We like to provide uh, products that can fit uh, a number of different roles. And speaking of different roles, we've got something brand new from you guys that I, I think is a completely different take on a med kit. Why don't you explain what this is and why this is special? I mean, we're used to that traditional belt-mounted kit, and this is a new approach. Explain it. Totally. So uh, we're all about trying to find issues and or find problems and then find solutions to the problem. So one thing that we found with IFAC kits is that they're real bulky. They tend to stick out a lot. They get snagged on things. When you open them up, it's just a, a ball of medical kit that goes all over the ground. Um, so I wanted to try and develop something that was going to be slim. It wasn't going to be invasive, uh, but you could access really easily. And so this is kind of what we came up with. Uh, this is, we don't have the official name yet, but for lack of a better term, it's just gonna be a plate carrier IFAC kit. Um, basically the way it works is it will sit on your plate carrier uh, via these Molly straps. The front end of it, you're gonna have a hydration pouch. So this will fit a, a, either a hydration pouch, you could put an IV bag in there. There's a little hydration port up here as well. If you want, you can just throw your little hydration port through there. Um, or if you want, you could put Lickies and Chewies, you could put, uh, yeah, I mean, really anything that you want will, will go up in this front pouch. Um, but we wanted to separate that from the rest of the bag just so you had more options to carry on your back. Um, but the great thing about it is this really doesn't stick out that far. So if it's full of all your medical kit, which we'll show here in a second, um, you're not going to add too much thickness to your overall plate carrier. So the way it'll work is this will sit on your plate carrier and then we have a pull tab that hangs down and this can be adjusted uh, to multiple heights. So if you don't want it dangling down, you want it nice and tight, you can do that as well. And we have a nice, easy to find handle. Uh, we just made this big and bulky. So when you're reaching back, it's easy to find, uh, especially if you have gloves on. And then all you do is you just pull down and then your entire IFAC kit comes out. When it comes out, you've got your IFAC kit nice and neat. You can access all your medical items. I think I think the big pull tab is key and you know in a situation where you would actually need something like this you don't want to be fumbling you don't want to be looking for a pull tab that's this big you know a tiny little thing you, I think that's a good idea totally yeah and, and we really wanted to make it so that it, it came out easily and again it's not invasive um, and, and it's you're gonna be able to fit more items in here than you would a traditional IFAC kit um, so basically what we're doing is we're taking something that's big and bulky and we're spreading it out over your back um, we're also really big on having things be multi-use so one we've got this strap this strap uh, will tie into the kit so when you're done working on your patient you throw this over your shoulder and you can move out if you decide and you, that you don't want to use this as an IFAC kit but you'd rather just use it as a general bag this will come off and this actually turns into your backpack straps so this will just come up into here or if you want to put it up higher you can put it up here it's really kind of up to the user as to where they want to place it you feed it through you buckle this in down below and now you have a, a backpack um, and then what happens is there's a little zipper down here all we do is we just zip this bad boy up throw this flap around and now you've got a backpack that you can use via the top zip up here so now you have a backpack and again you could throw that on your uh you could throw that on your plate carrier just so you have a backpack on your plate carrier or if you want we offer two straps 
and those two straps will carry it like a backpack. I think that's a really, really cool product, man. You know, the, the multi-use really seals it up because, you know, some guys, they want a product that, you know, they don't, they're not forced to use it a certain way. They can adapt it to what they need. And I, I think that's what you guys kind of look at with all the stuff you do. Absolutely. I mean, we, we'd rather you spend one time and have something that's going to be able to fill a number of different missions than make a hundred different products that's going to be super expensive. And, you know, you, you're only going to have this thing for this one specific mission. Is It's a little silly, especially for people that travel overseas. They can only bring a certain amount of things with them. You don't want a gazillion pouches. You'd rather have one pouch that's going to offer a number of different roles. And that's really what we were trying to accomplish with this well i think you've done a great job guys if you want to learn more about these are they on the site now uh, they'll be available in about five weeks in about five weeks check out refactortactical.com you'll see them all over tgc we appreciate their support they've been a supporter since day one so keep that in mind guys we support them they support us it's a great relationship we have be sure to check out the shot show 2017 sponsors new frontier armory and lehigh defense and as always guys thank you all for watching we'll see you soon